हेलो एवरी वन आई होप यू गाइज आर डूइंग अमेजिंग एंड एन पिंक ऑफ हेल्थ सो टूडे आई एम बैक विथ अनदर वीडियो अनदर डे अनदर वीडियो एंड वी विल लर्न द यूज ऑफ डिस्प्ले वैल्यू फंक्शन विच वी यूज अ क्वाइट ऑफ एन सो लेट मी फर्स्ट गिव यू ऑल अ क्विक ओवर व्यू ऑफ दिस फंक्शन ओके सो वी बेसिकली यूज दिस फंक्शन वेन वी वॉन्ट टू रिप्लेस अ वैल्यू विद अ वैल्यू विच इज मे बी कमिंग फ्रॉम सम अदर टेबल ओके सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग फॉर द मोर टाइम लेट्स गेट राइट इन टू द वीडियो सो एज यू ऑल कैन सी आई हैव दिस इंटरफेस ओपन विद मी वेर आई कैन सी ऑल द एप्लीकेशन इन अ रीड ओनली ग्रिड ओके सो इन द फर्स्ट कॉलम आई एम डिस्प्लेइंग द नेम्स ऑफ द एप्लीकेंट्स एंड द इन द सेकेंड कॉलम आई एम डिस्प्लेइंग द स्टेटस ओके विच इज इन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ इन टीचर विच इज नॉट अ वेरी गुड प्रैक्टिस राइट यू ऑल नो दैट हाउ लेट्स से आई एम अ यूजर ओके एंड इफ आई विल बी प्रजेंटेड विद दिस फॉर्म आई वुड नॉट नो राइट दैट दिस आई डी दिस स्टेटस आई डी बिलोंग्स टू दिस स्टेटस and this id belongs to this status right i would not know so think from you have to think from a user perspective so it's not a very good practice it doesn't come under best practices to display the ids you have to display the right status okay so to display the right status we are going to use display function because that is going to come from a ref table okay so now if you okay so now let's go uh, into the code and if you can see uh, i have uh, queried uh, this application data and then i have queried ref uh, table data status data okay so i have tried my level best uh, to keep the code you know very minimal so that uh, it will be easier for you guys to uh, read the code and understand the code so in these two uh, variables i am querying the data if you uh, see on the uh, right hand side okay so here i am fetching the data cool now if we take a look at this read only grid i can see the label then data which i am querying okay i am displaying the data in my grid which is coming from this table local applicants okay and then we have to two grid columns over here so in a status i have to display the status right right status status type status text you can say so now if i remove it from here and use my display function sorry my bad display value so it accepts four parameters okay so now i will walk you guys through uh, these four parameters one by one value so first one is value so the it is nothing but the value which we are going to replace so in our case the value is 1 2 3 which is being uh, shown on the ui okay and then comes uh, in array okay so we are going to look for that value in which array in local status table right so that is going to be our array okay uh, then comes replacement so our what we are going to replace our value with we are going to replace our value with the status uh, type right if uh, i uh, expand this and i can see the status right so i am going to replace the status id with this status so this is going to be the replacement value and then comes default let's say let's say it looks uh, for id 4 and as a result it returns nothing so in that case it will be uh, returning the default value it will display the default value okay so let's go ahead and test this function out let me just remove it from here and i'll just paste it this display function okay so in value parameter a uh, value will be status id right then comes array so we are going to look for this id status id in local status array in here in status and 
in this uh, in this id we will be looking for that id okay and then we have this we will be looking for this id let me just uh, copy this okay and paste this over here and comment this for the sec okay so we will be looking for this id in my array in this local status in here okay local status dot id got it and if i uncomment this code if i uncomment this code and uh, next comes replacement value so we will be replacing our id with the status okay so it will look for this id and then it will return the status of this id of one okay and the last one is default so if it looks for four it uh, and as a result it would it would not uh, return anything in that case it will be returning the null value cool okay let's remove this now and test this here you go you can see the applications and their name applicants and their name along with the status so jerry jerry has been interviewed and lucy's application status is new and the pr's application status is selected okay so i think that's all i have for today if you want more such videos please like my video share it as much as you can and yes don't forget to subscribe to my channel i'll see you guys in my next video until then cheers bye bye